How's it going boys? Welcome back to another video. Welcome to a new series. It's probably not going to be a series. It's really just a video. But if you're wondering who I am, I am your host. Um, sits at a desk job for eight hours a day and then comes home and sits in a different desk. McGee. But yeah, um, I know that people subscribe to the channel for the FIFA content, but to be honest, ask me if I want to, just, just ask me if I want to play FIFA. No, I, I just don't want to play FIFA. I hope you understand. I think if you like my FIFA content, you'll think this is kind of funny as well. Unless you like the FIFA because you think I'm good at FIFA. Not actually that good at FIFA. I have the same kind of dead humor in this, this style of video too. You know, the kind of humor that's not funny. If you really want, uh, I even have the glasses. So imagine it's buy or nah. The way I kind of, my intonation was in that last sentence, it didn't sound like I finished my sentence. But anyway, you're probably wondering what we're going to be watching. Uh, well, I asked on Twitter for you guys to send me a video, and then some people did, and I watched them, and I didn't understand them at all. So I'm going to go with a Logan Paul video. Now I'm just going to click on Logan Paul does Fortnite in real life. Wow, jumping on the Fortnite bandwagon? Who would ever do that? Now, for complete transparency, I have watched a minute and 22 seconds of this 9 minute and 19 long video. You know what's strange? He doesn't actually extend it to 10 minutes because he's <laughs> because he's demonetized. I just realized that's kind of mean. All right, well, anyway, I just want to make a disclaimer. Um, I don't hate Logan Paul or Jake Paul. I don't hate them. I don't like them. I think they're kind of douchebags, but uh, I just watch them because I think he's fascinating, kind of like... When you go to a zoo, you want to look at the animals because they live an entirely different life than what you do. They don't sit at a desk for nine hours. Second, my mom chopped up some ginger for me. Thank you, mom. Who eats ginger? What? I don't know what's going on. Why is he eating ginger? And why is he hooked up to an IV that's yellow? I had to get two IVs once. This is actually kind of a funny story. I got food poisoning about three months ago around New Year's Eve or New Year's. And I had to get two IVs and I vomited about 15 times and I was in the shower and poop was just coming out of me involuntarily. It was like breathing. That's what I'm here to do. My job is to uh, distract you from your busy life. We all got busy lives. We all got different stressful things going on. But I'm here to hopefully make you laugh and smile a little bit. I'm going to hold you to that, Logan. You better make me laugh and or smile. And my hoodie says it, <laughs> always plug. <laughs> Cop yourself some Maverick merch, the highest quality merch in the game. I was actually surprised that uh, it took him a minute and 15 seconds to plug his merch. And he even has always plug on his shirt. No shame. This is actually really boring. I don't know if people like vlogs. Uh, some people thought I should vlog. Not very many, but uh, some people thought I should vlog, and I thought, what would I vlog? I actually have a vlog. I went to a park. That was it. It was really boring. Look like a Fortnite? He just said, do I look like a Fortnite? You're not a knight. You're, you're a character. Do you know anyone with a giant blue butt? I do have one, right? And it's right there, right? Oh my god, honey. Ah. Why does he have a bus? I'm really confused. I'm confused why he was why he was getting an IV, why his vlog is just about him dressing up, and why he has a bus. Quick, we gotta collect supplies. Wait, what? Was like, wait, was that was that guy supposed to be in the shot? There was just some dude in the background who looked really concerned that a guy jumped out of a bus with an umbrella. Can we get a replay on that? What the f <laughs> Why is he just destroying things? I don't get it. I mean, I guess in Fortnite you destroy, you know, plants and trees and stuff for resources. But he's just trying to make noise. That's what this is. Noise. Little bell, I need you to hit it so it looks like it's ringing, right? Then you will be notified that I posted a new video. Um, because yeah, trust me, man. This shit is too lit, bro. You don't want to miss this. <laughs> this is something I'm not a huge fan of uh, about Logan, specifically. He acts like his vids are hot fire. Now, I don't think my vids are hot fire. 
because they aren't. I think some people like watching them. Some people obviously like watching Logan Paul's videos. But like that, that was just not a funny video or entertaining, really. You just kind of smash things. So it's fine that you he makes a living off this. I'm not really that jealous. Uh, but why does he gotta? Why does he have to act like he invented something insane when all he does is kind of poorly recreate Fortnite? for about five minutes and just smash things and then spend four minutes plugging merch and making the intro and the outro. All right, this looks like a very interesting video titled, I Met President Donald Trump by Jake Paul. I'm gonna take a wild guess and say that he actually didn't meet Donald Trump, but I really hope to be proven wrong. Okay, I already, I immediately know this is just not, <laughs> this is just so stupid. This is just such, you know what I like about Jake Paul? He doesn't care. He just makes the biggest lies. He clickbaits and thumb, does clickbait thumbnails just so outrageous that it's hilarious to look at. It is like going to the zoo. Logan's kind of like when you see the gorilla and he's like, wow, that guy's really muscular. That's kind of weird. Whereas Jake is kind of like the guy who throws the poop around. It's kind of like, what is he doing? What's he going to do next? First of all, if your plan was to click on this video and skip to the end to see if it is real or not, let me just save you the time. And uh, here's a clip of him arriving at the house. It's not, that's clearly not even, <laughs> come on, man. You know what I would appreciate if he was just so self-aware that you clicked on the video and then he goes, Hey guys, it's a clickbait thumbnail and title. I hope you guys enjoy it. Then I I watched his ad. I watched the ad at the beginning. He got he has his money. Now to being a part of the Jake Pollard community, we do so much lit stuff. Can you get on with it? It's been a minute and thirty seconds. You're still doing. You get the whole. You should just skip the first like two minutes of any Jake Paul or Logan Paul video because it's them just. Just like saying, hey, look, guys on my channel, buy my merchandise. Hey, I gotta make loud noises. Brr, brr, dolphin sounds. So with all that said, baby, welcome to the Everyday Bro Movement. Let's get it. Dog, what, what the heck, man? Two minutes, 33 seconds in. He's just doing another intro. It's like a second breakfast. Some people have second breakfasts. He's doing his second intro. I don't, we know your name's Jake Paul. Everyone knows. Why are you doing this? If the president's coming to your house, I'm a vlog it. China. It's what we do, the Jake Paulers. Why did it, that didn't even make any sense. Why did he put the China clip? I used to put that China clip because I would mention the name China. I wouldn't just say Donald Trump and then put China. I don't know, maybe I did that. I have to say, at least I am I am much more entertained by this video than I was with the Logan Paul one. The Logan Paul one is really stupid. Nothing happened. This one is also very stupid, but I'm like, how how much more how much dumber can this become? It's actually interesting. So the office reached out, Trump's office reached out because we have a huge influence on people and they wanna just sit down and talk and influence over kids specifically. It's gonna go and you can't film anything when he's here. I don't understand also the, like the plot is kind of interesting because I think it's really stupid, but the thing that makes it so dumb is why would you not be able to film? Like, I, unless they're talking about politics or some something really important. To be honest though, Donald Trump probably would hire Jake Paul to be his next advisor. And then he'd, he'd probably fire him after about three months, but it could happen. I don't know if I'm more scared about Donald Trump getting ideas from Jake Paul or Jake Paul getting ideas from Donald Trump. You know, the Secret Service wears like sunglasses and they have earpieces so they can communicate. They don't just wear all black suits. Those are the, that's the men in black. Those, those hunt aliens and not the aliens that Donald Trump is afraid of. Oh, give me a, give me a break. That's not what the Secret Service looks like. Those are like, that's a boy band. Hey. They really did not get the most flattering model to portray Donald Trump. 
I'm not saying that he's in great shape, although he thinks that he's in excellent shape. Do you want to water anything? I'm good, thank you. Okay, <laughs> that doesn't sound anything like him. This is so absurd. I like take him upstairs. He comes over here. He checks out our view. And he's like, nice, Bill, this is a sick view, blah, blah, blah. Talks to me about something. <laughs> then Donald Trump casually, he goes, yeah, bro, this is a sick view, dog. <laughs> then we had a meeting about the Syrian refugee crisis. <laughs> You know, I've always wanted to meet the President of the United States and um, I think like I want to help him think better about our generation. But yeah guys, cap yourself in the hottest merch in the game. <laughs> it's so funny because it sounds like Jake Paul is actually going to make some a serious sentiment, a serious remark for once. He wants to help the President. You know, there's the March for Our Lives, a lot of movements going on, a very tumultuous time for a generation in the United States and Jake Paul wants to help him think better by the way cop my merch down below hit that subscribe button with your head all right uh that was more entertaining than the Logan Paul one both people they're they're really annoying to watch but I kind of I thought it was kind of funny hopefully you enjoyed the reaction if you did drop a like in the next video I'm meeting President Ronald Reagan and uh, I see you boys next time as always don't forget to spare pets